everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be showing you my pamper night routine. So usually I like to start my pamper nights off with a bath. So I'm using a Lush bath bomb today. Once I have a bath, I definitely like to remember to moisturize. So I'm using my Vaseline Cocoa Butter Lotion. This is by far my favorite lotion. And I find that the moisture definitely lasts longer with that lotion. Once I do that, I'm going to go ahead and make sure I brush out my hair. I prefer to use a comb just because I think it's a little bit more gentle on my hair. So that is what I am using. Once I do that, I'm going to go in with my Bior pore strips. I am using the charcoal ones. I find that they work the best. And you do have to wet your nose prior to using these. I didn't show that in the video, but I definitely did do that. And then I'm going to go in with my favorite face mask right now. And this is the Charcoal and Black Sugar Face Scrub. It is like a face mask, but it also is an exfoliator. So I really like this right now. And I'm sure you guys will notice throughout this video my iPad. Um, pamper nights for me, I really just like to relax, so I'm watching One Tree Hill throughout this whole video. If you haven't watched One Tree Hill before, you definitely should. It's a really great show, and I would definitely recommend it. I've watched the entire, um, series at least five times now, and I still love it. So definitely check that out if you haven't. This mask is really nice because it gives a kind of warming sensation, so I really like it. And you're going to leave that on somewhere between 5 and 7 minutes. You can leave it on longer if you want. Um, on my pamper nights, I definitely like to treat myself a little bit. So I have been obsessed with chocolate-covered strawberries lately. So I'm just melting some regular chocolate chips and mixing it with a teaspoon of coconut oil just to thin it out. And then I just cut my strawberries in half and I dip them and I kind of like to let the chocolate drain off quite a bit just so it's not super thickly coated on there. So I just do that and then I put them on some parchment paper and I just throw them in the fridge for 5 to 10 minutes and that's all you need to do for that. Now that my face mask has set, um, you can go ahead and wash that off. And then, of course, the best part, pulling off your nose strip. I hope everyone else finds that as enjoyable as I do. Now that I have a clean face, I'm ready to do my skincare. My skincare, I definitely keep pretty basic. I use pretty natural things on my face. So I'm going to go in with my um, Fruit of the Earth Vitamin E Cream. This is a really natural... Um, cream. I used to have really bad acne and I find that since I've stopped using really harsh chemicals on my face and using more natural things, my skin has cleared up quite a bit. So that is what I'm using. And then I'm going to go in with my aloe vera gel. Um, I've heard a lot of mixed reviews on using this on your face. I personally really like it. It keeps my skin super soft and super hydrated. So it is one of my um, like holy grail skincare products. So I definitely would recommend trying that if um, you have super dry skin. If you guys want to see a full skincare routine, definitely let me know. The last part of my pamper routine is painting my nails. Um, I painted them pink here, so you can see how I do that. Really basic stuff. I'm sure that you guys know how to paint your nails. Um, that is all for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video, and comment down below what you guys want to see next. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you have a great day. I'm going to finish off the lips with Max Shy Girl, and that looks like this. It is just a kind of like a peachy, shimmery 